Roanoke County continues to see growth in terms of both business and residents. But in some of the more rural areas where growth is a possibility, no broadband internet is a non-starter. The county sees this problem and is working to change it. And 10 News reporter Shane Dwyer shows us why resident surveys could be the key to making that happen. Earlier this summer, we introduced you to Debbie Lehman and her low-speed way of life. She and her husband live just over the mountain in northern Roanoke County, but sometimes they feel a world away. When we moved out here, we didn't need it. Now we do. It's just like, you know, electricity. You know, we need electricity. Now we need broadband. Just 12 miles from downtown Roanoke, but much of this area lacks stable broadband. Roanoke County IT Director Bill Hunter recognizes the problem with a county wanting to be a regional leader lacking full connectivity. His team wants to shrink the gap between the broadband haves and have-nots. We literally have some residents in the county that can see where the internet ends and the expense to get it from there to their home is, is just tremendous. The goal is state grants to offset some of that expense. Hunter's desk is stacked full of survey responses. They sent out tens of thousands of them to learn exactly who isn't connected. Right now, they think they're pushing 90% of households, but that may be too high. That is an unrealistic number, and I think this survey is going to show that the county is much lower in percentage of connectivity than we currently advertise we are. They've received about 1,000 responses, and the survey ends at the end of the month. They hope as many as possible will come in the door because good data leads to the best plan. The most attractive county with a bad plan is not going to be a grant recipient. Layman filled her survey out and has her fingers crossed. She hopes to be able to celebrate broadband at her house sometime soon. And that was Shane Dwyer reporting. County leaders are asking anyone who got that survey to please fill it out and return it. Even if you have broadband, they say it's important to respond. That way they can get the most accurate map possible.